Hello, Peter Newman with you and welcome to the first RE Insight for 2024. Now every time I've given a presentation about harvest weed seed control, the question always comes up without fail, will the weeds just evolve to evade harvest weed seed control? Will they grow prostrate or shed their seeds? So yes, it's possible, uh, but we haven't seen much of it yet. Now, in the next couple of RE Insights, we're going to talk about this. In this RE Insight, we're going to talk about some computer modelling on the issue. And in the next one, we're going to talk about a population of wild radish that is actually shedding its pods early. So firstly, the computer modelling. So Dr. Mike Ashworth and Gail Somerville teamed up to develop a computer model to predict wild radish flowering time under selection. So a few years ago, Mike Ashworth essentially bred early flowering wild radish by selecting early flowering radish, crossing them with one another, and found some radish that evolved to flower after just 29 days, which is about half the normal flowering time. Now in this study, he and Gail developed a computer model to look at that under field conditions, not that ideal sort of breeding conditions. So in the field conditions, the model predicted that yes, early flowering time was easy to select for, and yes, it, uh, it did select for early flowering, but only 12 days short of flowering, rather than the 29 that Mike observed. And also the model found that the early flowering didn't really happen as long as there was diversity in the system. If herbicides were working well, if growers were using all of the Weed Smart Big Six, for example, to control weeds, then that selection for early flowering didn't really happen in the computer model. So this is a really good way of testing what could happen, build a computer model to see what could happen uh, over many years rather than having to wait to find out. So great bit of work by Mike and Gail, and we'll talk in, in our next edition of RE Insight about the wild radish that is dropping its pods. But for more information, take a look at RE Insight.